Hello and a good day. Um, my name is Meir Bartou. I'm the CEO of Optical Zone. To my right is Fasad Gadoshahi, who is the CTO, VP of Engineering, and a co founder of Optical Zone. We've been working together for more than 20 years. Um, I would like to start by thanking the LHM of Commerce for its initiative trying to um, recognize export from local companies and specifically for choosing us this year for this award. We appreciate it very much. OZC has been in business for 20 years. Um, we design and manufacture fiber optic equipment um, for telecommunication and communication. Um, among our customers are the biggest names that you can think about it, like Verizon, AT&T, Boeing, Lockheed, uh, Sprint, SpaceX, government, and many more. For years, we were counting on word of mouth and web searches for people to find us um, for export, and that's basically how we build our export markets that actually grew to almost 30% of our total sales. We even have had a failed effort to open an office in London that uh, failed, but that's a very sad story for some other time. So I will ask Fasad to tell you more of what we actually do, and then I'll let you know what we are trying to do about export beyond what we have done so far. Fasad. Thank you. Uh, as Mary mentioned, we do dev make product for fiber optic uh, market. Uh, we serve uh, markets such as uh, cellular coverage enhancement, which is providing uh, coverage inside the building. You may find us in many stadiums, uh, very large venues where uh, we support all carriers and all phones to people have access to coverage. Uh, we also provide uh, satellite communication products. Uh, our customers are uh, SpaceX, uh, Boeing, uh, NASA uh, and that providing uh, communication to satellites from ground. Um, uh, we also support the onboard ship satellite communications, providing coverage onboard ship to the satellites. And finally, we do a lot of work for the military and defense, uh, Navy, Army, they are all our customers and, uh, and those are somewhat as unique uh, fiber optic uh, products based on our standard uh, product that we have, uh, we have developed already. So our standard products are standard for us. We have patents, we have IP, we have some innovation. So there is some uniqueness here mm -hmm. in the LA basin for some high-tech uh, companies. But going back to export, we, um, we have decided to actually put a focus on export and the US commercial services have been specifically helpful in guiding us towards establishing a worldwide network of distributors. With their support, we've been able to select a distributor in Singapore and build a deeper relationship with some of the key customers in Singapore already. We have uh, uh, distributors now in Italy, in Scandinavia, Germany, and we have had a distributor in Israel for many years. Um, the help of the US commercial services cannot be um, overemphasize. Without them, probably we would not have been able to access um, so many um, companies and to vet so many uh, potential distributors. So obviously, thank you, the U.S. Commercial Services, for your uh, um, uh, continuous support. Um, I want to kind of uh, finalize by saying that this days of virtual conferences and virtual meetings, um, we hope you'll also help us uh, reach a much wider audience all over the world because we can do it with less travel and we can put more focus on materials and other elements to ex enhance our export. So again, thank you, LA Chamber of Commerce. Thank you, the US Commercial Services. And we hope to report uh, in a year much success to our investment this year. Thank you again. Thank you.